I'm a bit late to the party on weighing in on Intel's latest education campaign involving Apple, nicknamed the Apple Spell, but I wanted to write about it before we go into Apple's event the next week. I also wanted to see some of the reactions and see if I had anything incremental to say. I wasn't surprised to see some polarizing takes as Apple anything is polarizing. At the highest level, I don't believe anyone should criticize anyone for calling out a powerful and successful company like Apple or for that matter, Facebook, Amazon, Microsoft or Google, on its value propositions, we should all be questioning this. At all times, Apple has a monopoly on smartphone profits and while only having single digit PC unit share, likely walks away with 30% of the profit dollars, we should be harder on the most powerful companies. There is no doubt that Apple has been innovative at times. It was rarely if ever first out with categories, but it has history of getting categories right. It wasn't first with the smartphone, but got capacitive touch and an app store with the iPhone. It wasn't first with the smartwatch, but I believe it's the one to beat with watch. It wasn't the first with a notebook computer, but it was with the thinnest one, the MacBook Air. It wasn't the first with wireless earbuds, but it has a very high quality offering with AirPods. I could go on and on. I do want to say that Apple has been quite proficient with so CS, more successful than any device maker I have seen in history. So I think it's fair for Intel, or anyone for that matter, to call out Apple when it's not being very innovative. And, yes, I know Intel has a commercial purpose here.